Mulago, Kubiri, Mulago Farewell Home and Peak Road are among the 27 junctions that the Kampala Capital City Authority plans to equip with traffic signals during this financial year. This initiative is part of a broader infrastructure development effort within the city. Dorothy Kisaka, KCCA's Executive Director, announced that approximately 80 kilometers of roads will be rehabilitated under the Kampala City Roads Rehabilitation Project. The project, costing 288 million US dollars, is funded through a loan from the African Development Bank. Our goal is to complete the 80 kilometers under the Kampala City Roads Rehabilitation Project and uh, the roads that I've already mentioned, a few are finished. This year, significant road rehabilitation work will also include Clare Road, Old Kampala Ring Road, Rashidi Kamisi and Ben Chwanka Street. These improvements are part of the Greater Kampala Metropolitan Area Urban Development Program for which KCCA has secured a 2.1 trillion shillings loan from the World Bank. KCCA aims to increase the coverage of street lighting from 67% to 81.8%. This is a big priority for KCCA in this uh, financial year, which will add to the earlier stock of roads already mentioned and deal with the issues of potholes in the city. Efforts will also be made to enhance the city's drainage systems, including ongoing work on the Rubiji and Nakamilo channels and the commencement of construction on the Nalukolongo and Mayanja channel. These upgrades are designed to prevent flooding and eliminate water stagnation, which can lead to disease in surrounding communities. We shall continue to repair and construct community drainages to curb stagnation that may cause disease. Kisaka further mentioned plans to decommission the Kitezi dumping site and open the Dundu landfill in Mukono, where waste will be recycled. We want to achieve a higher goal of recycling, at least an increase by 5% of garbage, treating and releasing 200 amounts of leachate to the natural environment. Becca Senyunga Mulinde, NTV.